you guys touch the game here, bring you a quick um, tutorial on how to install the Sonic Heath as Unbelievable Shadies mod. Um, now, unfortunately, it's for 1.4.7 and it does not use this texture pack which I've got in the background, mainly for the reason that I don't know how to install it. Um, but the reason I'm doing this video is because you don't need to downgrade your Minecraft, uh, even though it is for 1.4.7. Um, and it's basically the fastest way I've found and really really easy to do. Now, um, all you will need for this is the tech uh, launcher and that's it. You don't need to download Sandy Heathers or anything, just the tech launcher. Now, I've already got it up here. Now, on the tech launcher, if you notice there was a new design um, and there's Hackslash Mine, Yogbox, Vaults, Techit, Techit Lite, and then it says Add New Pack. Now, a lot of people don't know what this is. Uh, if you don't, then I'll explain it. If you do, then maybe skip ahead. Uh, but for the people that don't know, um, there's a website called the Technic Platform, uh, and on it, uh, it's basically you go on mod packs and press browse mod packs. And as you know, like all the famous mod packs like Yogbox and everything, um, well, they've given like, normal players the opportunity to make their own. And on Braz mod packs, there's hundreds of thousands of mod packs uh, made by different players, uh, which you can try them out yourself. Which, I, if you can see here, I have tried out quite a few. Oh. Tried out quite a few, uh, and I have got a few favourites. Uh, but for this particular one, I'll leave a link in the description um, to this. Now this is the GLS, uh, GLSL mod pack. Now it's really clever how they've done this, but if you notice on here, it says paste platform URL here. Uh, what's that? Oh, yeah, but it says paste platform URL here. Now, um, you go onto the uh, link I sent you in the description. I accidentally opened Steam. I hate doing that. <laughs> But uh, you go on this, and then it says copy URL right next to this chat box in on the description. I think. No, it's on everything. Um, but press copy URL right here, and it will say URL copy to clipboard. Uh, so you minimize this, and close Steam, and then when you click on this, you press paste, and that will say something, like, and then it will come up with the link you just sent. Uh, now, if it if you did this correctly, which is really hard not to, uh, you press Add Mod Pack, which I've already done, and it should be right here. Uh, now, after you've done that, you press Launch, and it should download. It might take like a few minutes, uh, but since I've already done it, then it won't take as long. Um, now, uh, after you've done that, you just press Single Player, open the new world. Um, and you should have Sonic Ethers if you've done it correctly, like I said, which is really hard not to. Um, and yeah, that's it. This is the fastest way I've seen to install Sonic Ethers because I know a lot of people struggle to. Um, so if this video has helped you in any way, um, yeah, please do um, do what you can to help. So yeah, as you can see, the leaves are moving, um, the light is just amazing, if I go over to the water, I think it's over here, yeah, as you can see the water's moving, it's like see-through, so everything's running fine, um, so yeah, you get all the settings from shaders, and the mod is installed correctly. Now, like I said, I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please rate, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you next time, guys.